good afternoon students today i am discussing about for your uh, upcoming examinations uh, some important questions uh, so look first of all we will know define some important topic so first of all define what circulatory system circulatory system okay so look students circulatory system defined means the circulatory system is responsible for transport of various substances in human beings and is composed in the heart arteries veins and blood capillaries what the circulatory system is the responsible for transport of various substances in human being and it's composed of the heart arteries um, veins and blood capillaries understood so this all that's all now look define blood so blood also another important topic i mean define blood means define blood is the circulating fluid contained in the heart and the blood uh, vessels such as arteries veins and capillaries of the circulatory system so circulatory system is the system is responsible for the transport of various substances in human being but blood blood is the circulating fluid contained in the heart and the blood vessels such as arteries veins and capillaries of the circulatory system understood now look another important thing what heart so look uh, actually heart is the uh, heart is the muscular system a uh, muscular pumping uh, organ what heart is the muscular pumping organ which pushes the blood around the body and has different chambers such as right atrium left atrium right ventricle left ventricle to the prevent the mixing of oxygenated blood and carbon dioxide rich blood so heart actually define heart when uh, anyone tell you uh, what is the heart that time you what you will tell the heart heart is the muscular pumping organ which uh, pushes the blood around the body and uh, has different chambers such as right atrium left atrium and right ventricle left ventricle to the prevent the mixing of oxygenated blood and the carbon dioxide reach the blood so this is the heart understood now look another important thing rh factor rh factor so rh factor also another important thing because rh factor is the an inherited antigen of often found on the blood cells what rh factor is an inherited antigen often found on the blood cells some individuals have these antigens and are thus rh positive i mean rh positive means rh plus rh plus mean rh positive while other who do not have this antigen are rh negative understood rh negative so rh minus so rh factor is an inherited antigen often found on the blood cells uh, some individuals have these antigens and they are the are thus uh, rh factor plus i mean rh positive while other who do not have the this antigen are rh negative so with antigen rh positive and without antigen do not have this antigen so that time we call rh negative understood so from circulatory system this topic very very important for your upcoming examination circulatory system define circulatory system definition of circulatory system definitions of blood definitions of heart definition of rh factor so now look another important question so another important question uh, what uh, structural difference between white blood cells and red blood cells so difference between uh, difference between uh, wbc i mean white blood cell and red blood cells okay 
सो लुक स्टूडेंट्स व्हाइट ब्लड सेल्स मीन्स व्हाइट ब्लड सेल्स आर एमियोबॉइड वट व्हाइट ब्लड सेल्स आर एमियोबॉइड एंड रेड ब्लड सेल्स रेड ब्लड सेल्स आर मेनिट बायोकॉन के बिग्स लाइक स्ट्रक्चर सो स्ट्रक्चरल डिफरेंस मीन्स स्ट्रक्चर डिफरेंस सो व्हाइट ब्लड सेल्स आर एमोबॉइड एंड रेड ब्लड सेल्स आर मेनिट बायोकॉन के लाइक स्ट्रक्चर and another important difference between uh, white blood cells and red blood cells the white blood cells they are nucleated uh, nucleoid cells i mean white blood cells have nucleated cells and red blood cells uh, anucleated cells understood and hemoglobin is absent in red blood cells i mean white uh, and hemoglobin in present in the red blood cells what hemo sorry hemoglobin is absent in white blood cells and hemoglobin in present in red blood right blood cells okay so now look another important questions for your upcoming examination what are the functions of blood plasma what what are the functions functions of blood plasma so what are the functions functions actually uh, the functions of blood plasma transports of digested food from the alimentary ca canal to tissues and another important uh, functions of blood plasma transport excretory materials from tissues to excretory organs and now another important functions of blood plasma distributes the hormones from the glands to their target safe and uh, distributes the uh, heat in the body to maintain the body temperature also understood now look another important questions for your upcoming examination state the functions of blood so blood plasma also another thing and uh, blood also another thing so now look functions of the blood what functions of the blood so look students uh, there are many uh, many many functions are there but now look only uh, important functions of blood transport of digested from uh, food from the alimentary canal to tissues and these substances are simple sugars like glucose amino acids vitamins uh, mineral salts etc so another important functions of blood transport of oxygen in the form of an unstable compounds uh, oxygen uh, uh, oxyhemoglobin from the lungs to the tissue what transport of oxygen in the form of the and unstable compounds oxygen oxyhemoglobin uh, from the lungs to the tissues and another important functions of the blood transport of carbon dioxide from the tissues to the lungs and another important things transport to excretory man, material from the tissues to the liver kidney or the skins from uh, eliminations and distribution of hormones from glands to the target sites and another important uh, functions of blood distribution of heat to keep the body temperature uniform understood so these are all about for today's and li carefully listen my voice study at your home so if you have any queries ask me by phone or message i'm always always with you okay thank you